All right, welcome in to Good Day here at 6 o'clock on a Tuesday. I'm John Paul. And I'm Kelsey Cairns. Shelby County school leaders looking for better ways to get students to school and parents that may not have to pay a penny. Local 24 News reporter Jalen Sochek is live for us from Mattis headquarters in downtown Memphis ahead of the district's board meeting. And Jalen has a look at what the board is considering tonight. Jalen. Yeah, John and Kelsey, the school board could uh, approve a partnership with Mata that would provide free city bus passes to 3,000 students and their parents. Students previously told them about some of the difficulties they face, including costs, when it comes to just simply getting to school. So for this partnership, the district has set aside $300,000 to pay for each of those $100 bus passes, which would be good for a whole year. Matta says this will allow them to start to improve public transportation access to students. The district hopes this will mean less absences for students and improved work at school. The passes come with no time limitations so students can use them to also get to work and for after school activities which the district doesn't provide late buses for. Many students may travel across the district to get um, to their school of choice and so uh, what we heard from many students is again they needed those additional options for transportation. And applications for these bus passes would be available and open to all students, but priority would be given based on enrollment and income. If it does get approved tonight, these passes could be coming as early as this fall. Reporting live in downtown Memphis, Shailen Sochek, Good Day Memphis.